Brothers, this is Dr. Phil Chavez of the Men's Academy. The month of May was named after the ancient Greek goddess Maya, the feminine variant of the word also known in Latin as Maius and Maior, signifying greater. Now this great goddess Maya is considered the goddess of fertility and spring, which is a fitting connection for May with all of its growth and its increase. Now the Romans later referred to, as the May, to this May goddess as the Bona Dea, meaning the good goddess. She was associated with chastity and fertility in Roman women, healing and the protection of the state. Sacrifices were made to Maya on the first day of the month, otherwise later known as May Day. She would be queen goddess of this ancient festival for the sake of nature worship. Now in medieval England, May Day was a holiday when the youth went into the woods to bring back a maypole made from a tree trunk and garlands of flowers would be collected as well as other natural decorations for the Maypole. The May Queen would be honored around the Maypole and crowned. Sometimes there would be celebration with the accompaniment of the May King who would be crowned also. Now for Christians, the month of May is devoted to the Catholic veneration of the great Queen, the Virgin Mary, and the high point of honoring her remains, the ceremony of crowning. That ritual was introduced by St. Philip Neri in the 16th century and intended as a substitute for the pagan May Day Festival. Now, the ceremony involves young boys and girls processing to a statue of Mary and placing a crown of flowers on her head. Of course, hymns and songs are included honoring her as Queen of Heaven, Queen of, Heaven, Queen of Earth, Queen of the Universe. Christ, of course, is the Messianic King with whom she serves in union. Brothers, accompany the Blessed Mother this month of May. Crown her as queen of your life. Walk in union with her and you will bring blessing and increase upon yourself, your family, and your community. Oh, and brothers, don't forget to plan for Mother's Day. God be with you.